we as a club, we need to be educated and we need to know more about Indigenous culture and um, we're doing a lot of work around that. We do a lot of work around that and we've, we've come a long way. Um, there's still a long way to go and um, it starts with us up top and it starts with the Indigenous boys helping us out and um, I guess for me it's about learning more about their culture so that I can relate but then that also I can help educate more and more people outside of the club and then once you get that build up because we've got such a great platform where we are with the Adelaide Football Club, we wear the, we wear the crest on our polos and all our training guns. is the way that we've got this platform we can then spread it out and not just our family and friends but also on social media and the big reach that we've got that way so um, really important for us as leaders but also important for the whole club to educate. Back it goes again. Okay. We've got a lot of Indigenous boys here and we have over the journey um, who are all great characters and are happy to I guess share their journey and, and their culture and what it means to them and I guess for me it's um, embracing that and, and trying to learn and, and enjoying it with them and, and spending the week with them learning about um, as I said yeah their culture and, and what it means to them. throughout the year, it's not just one round, it's, um, it's really important that we're all, as I said, educating ourselves, um, you know, learning about their culture, enjoying their culture and, and where they've come from and, um, you know, if you get the chance to speak to these guys, they've got some great stories um, about family and, um, and, their, and their past. Eddie's been, he's been a constant presence, he's a, he's a bubbly man, he's always up and about, um, he's always up for a chat too and um, he's had a big role to play with a lot of the Indigenous boys and their, their transition from either 18 year olds moving out of home or coming from a sample club with Shano and things like that. Um, I've had a few chats to him here and there and he's just, he's just always wanting to educate, always wants to learn from us and always wants to help out others. He's just a, a really genuine man and uh, really honest and he's just great to have around. I think my favourite part would be the, the intricacies with it. You've got um, a shield on the back here which represents the Ghana people and then even something like We Flies One translated to Ghana on, um, on the back here as well. So there's a few little things. There's obviously the big um, arms wrapping around like Eddie, um, having his arms around us. You've got the hand there as well. All that stuff's cool. I just like the little details that they put in there. I think this round's perfect for just throwing yourself into that um, Indigenous round, embracing it and really learning and, and understanding their culture.